The automotive industry is one of the most dynamic industries in the world. Each year, outdated models are retired and replaced with new ones. Have you ever wondered, though, how it all started? The invention of the automobile and the revolutionization of the automotive industry are attributed to two men, Gottlieb Daimler and Carl Benz. We will take a deep look into their past in this video, exploring their early beginnings as independent inventors to the creation of Mercedes-Benz, one of the most respected and admired brands in the automotive world. Here's a reminder, if you have not let subscribe to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any newly uploaded videos. And hang on till the end of this video, this story will definitely inspire you. Beginning Benz, who was born in Karlsruhe, Germany, in 1844, had a childhood interest in mechanical engineering. After that, he continued his education at the University of Karlsruhe, and in 1871, he opened his own engineering firm. Another German engineer and inventor, Gottlieb Daimler, was born in Schondorf, Germany, in 1834. Before focusing on engines and cars, he worked as a gunsmith for a while. It all started in the 1880s when Carl Benz was working as an engineer in Mannheim, Germany. Benz spent a lot of his leisure time tinkering with his inventions since he was always interested in engines and engineering. Benz Patent Motor Wagon one day he had an idea for a new type of engine that could be used in a vehicle. Over the years that followed, he worked on improving his concept and creating prototypes. Finally, in 1885, he revealed the Benz Patent Motor Wagon, his first automobile. The motor wagon was a three-wheel vehicle with a single cylinder for power. It could go up to 25 miles on a single gas tank and reach a top speed of 10 miles per hour. It was a groundbreaking creation that helped to establish the basis for the modern car. Daimler Motor Carriage Another German engineer, Gottlieb Daimler, was developing his own concepts for a high-speed engine at the same time. Daimler was a brilliant inventor who gained recognition for his innovations related to gasoline engines. He thought that a lightweight, high-speed engine that could be used in a range of vehicles holds the key to the future of transportation. In 1886, Daimler unveiled his first automobile, the Daimler Motor Carriage. It had two cylinders to power the four-wheeled vehicle. It could go up to 50 miles on a single tank of petrol and had a top speed of 10 miles per hour. It was an incredible accomplishment that forever changed the history of automobiles. Daimler Benz AG Despite their shared interest in automotive technology, Benz and Daimler had never met. It wasn't until 1882 that they finally crossed paths. Benz had heard about Daimler's work on gas engines and was eager to meet the man behind the technology. The two got along well right away and started working together on a new kind of engine for a vehicle. The two of them produced the Mercedes 35 PS, the very first Mercedes-Benz car. The car was a slick, powerful machine that blended the very best aspects of Daimler and Benz design. Consumers loved it, so the two entrepreneurs decided to combine their businesses to establish Daimler-Benz AG. The new company became well-known in the automobile world very quickly by building some of the most recognizable vehicles ever, like the Mercedes-Benz 600 Pullman and the 300 SL. However, they faced certain difficulties along the way to accomplish success. In recent years, Mercedes-Benz has faced increasing competition from other luxury automakers, as well as the rise of electric and autonomous vehicles. Let's not forget the humor in all of this. It's difficult to imagine what might have happened to the world if Gaudi Daimler and Carl Benz had never met. Who knows, maybe we'd have flying cars by now or we'd all still be traveling in horse-drawn carriages. What do you think about it? All we can say for sure is that, without these two exceptional inventions, the world certainly would have looked very different. In fact, their inventions have paved the way for some of the most ridiculous car designs ever made. One such vehicle was the three-wheeled Reliant Robin, which had a bad reputation for tipping over in the slightest wind. Of course, there's the AMC Pacer, which looks like a fishbowl on wheels. But despite the occasional design mishap, the automotive industry has advanced significantly since the days of Gaudi Daimler and Carl Benz. Present-day Mercedes-Benz 
Even after a number of difficulties over the years, Mercedes-Benz is still one of the most renowned and well-known brands in the automobile industry today. It has always remained true to the vision of its founders to build the best cars in the world. When considering Mercedes-Benz's past, it is evident that Carl and Gaudi Daimler, the company's founders, were responsible for most of its success due to their vision, passion, and hard work. Even though they started out as two inventors tinkering in their workshops, their legacy has truly changed the world. In the end, it's hard not to feel a sense of awe and gratitude for what these two men have accomplished. They took a simple idea the automobile, and turn it into a global industry that has transformed the way we live, work, and play. And in the process, they created a legacy that will live on for many more years. So, let's thank Benz and Daimler, the dynamic partnership that transformed the motor industry and gifted us the concept of the vehicle. May their legacy continue to inspire the next generation of innovators and dreamers for years to come. Now, that brings us to the end of the video. Thank you for being to the end of the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and tell us what you think about this video below in the comment section. Let's meet again with another interesting video.